Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Pop Up News. Today I come to you with a video about Elchin Sangu and Barış Arduç. Before I move into my video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and press the like button. Thank you and let's get on to my video. Barış Arduç, a popular Turkish actor, is showing his frustration with Elchin Sangu. His ex-co-star in the popular TV show Kiralı Kaşık. Recently, Arduç made a statement suggesting that he was not pleased with the way his co-star had been treating him while on set. In an interview with a Turkish media outlet, Arduç expressed his dissatisfaction with Elçin Sangu's behavior and attitude. He said that Sangu had been disrespectful towards him and had not shown the same level of respect that he had expected from her as a fellow actor. Arduç also mentioned that he was not pleased with the way Sangu had been acting on the set and that it had been causing problems for him and the rest of the cast and crew. The statement made by Arduç sent shockwaves through the Turkish media and it seems that his comments have caused a rift between the two actors. The situation has become increasingly strained between the two and many fans have expressed their concern over the situation. In response to the comments made by Arduç, Elçin Sangu has responded by saying that she believes her co-star is acting out of emotion and that she has no intention of engaging in a public feud. She also acknowledged that there may have been some miscommunication between the two of them, but that she had no intention of engaging in a verbal altercation with her co-star. The situation between Barış Arduç and Elçin Sangu has certainly caught some tension between them again. Many fans are hoping that the two can settle their differences and continue to work together in the future. As they have been one of the most popular duos in the show's history. However, with Arduç's recent comments, it's unclear if that will be possible. Thank you very much for watching my video. See you in the next one. Take care and goodbye.